Well, it seems like there's a new construction project on every street corner in Nashville. Hi everyone, I'm Rory Johnston. And I'm Carrie Sharp. And some of those projects may be a sticking around just a little bit longer. Developers have gotten word from NES their completion dates may have to be moved back. Yeah, News Channel 5's Chris Davis explains why. In a city where the ground is always churning, the only thing that may slow down Nashville's current construction boom. All through Middle Tennessee right now, the housing demand is very high. Is the ability to power it all once they're done. We have about 25 people ready to move in in June. David McGowan is the president of Regent Homes, a major Middle Tennessee developer. The industry is in a state of chaos. He says he's had projects delayed all across Middle Tennessee due to the scarcity of a type of transformer. We're waiting on the single phase power where it's step it down to be able to feed the individual apartments. And without that single piece of equipment, they're often forced to wait. They cannot give us a guaranteed date when we have the transformers. We have to notify the customers that are planning to move in uh, that we're we're held up basically because of power. Well, it's it it has been a challenge. Uh, Jack Baxter with you know, Nashville Electric says you know, supply chain problems began with the pandemic. Part of it is is labor shortage. Uh, part of it is raw material supply on on their part. And strong storms have only made it worse. And we just ask that everybody be patient with us. Um, you, you know, again, this this isn't it's not just a national electric service problem. It's a utility problem and really a developer problem nationwide. But NES is working on solutions between literally digging up unused transformers to digging up old solutions from the past. And that was to go back to a pole mounted transformer, just like you were seeing the subdivisions built back in the 30s and the 50s. For another Regent Homes property, NES worked out a deal to erect this temporary transformer on a pole. And that could eventually be an answer for this apartment complex in Cane Ridge. We do everything we can to meet the demand that the customers are putting on us in Nashville. Until then, you may see a lot of construction equipment crying to a halt. Chris Davis, News Channel 5. Chris, thank you. NES says this nationwide supply chain issue may not let up anytime soon. However, they're making sure they keep a stockpile in place in case there's another major storm so that power outages can be fixed as quickly as possible.